hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel i can't wait to show you guys all the adorable things that i found this week so let's get right into the video first stop was home goods and they did have the new hello kitty disposable cups i was so excited to find these i ended up grabbing a few more sets because i want them to be able to last me a very long time just because they are so cute they also had these adorable hello kitty plates we did see the pink ones already i did not see these napkins yet i love how it says hello kitty in the front but i just feel like they're so pretty that i would never want to use them but they also had these that we've seen already i haven't seen these red ones yet but they were cute 3.99 and we did see those hello kitty ones on the left there already as well those were also 3.99 they have these cute little school napkins and I thought those ghost plates were so cute. Here are the red Hello Kitty cups. I did not grab this one. Even They were cute but not as cute as the pink ones. After Home Goods, I headed to a Kroger and you guys, they put out the new Sanrio Squishmallows. The Halloween ones, they were so, so cute. I would say the Kiromi and the Hello Kitty Frankenstein were probably my favorite. But I did not even know that they were putting these out i was just walking in the halloween aisle because i was looking for this ghost mug that i had seen somebody post but as i was looking they had new clips they had new halloween like regular halloween squishmallows and you guys this bag was filled with all the new halloween squishmallow clips they had a ton I was trying to be fast so a worker wouldn't come up to me and be like, do you need help? Ugh, I hate it when they do that. But they had about six styles. This little pumpkin was probably my favorite. And here's a quick little view of all the Halloween stuff they had out. And this is the mug that I was telling you guys about. Such a cute little ghost mug. I saw that in this bin, it looked like a pumpkin spice latte. But when I pulled it out, I was like, ew, it's kind of ugly. <laughs> I wish I didn't have that pumpkin face on it. But that bat was cute. And here's day two of hunting. And first up was home goods. But they only had these Hello Kitty mugs that we've all seen. Then I headed to Burlington. Still looking for that fall glass mug, you guys. But... I think I missed it, but they did have this cute donut mug, and they still had this Hello Kitty mug that I showed you guys in my previous video. It's super cute, but I have a ton already. I'm being very selective. I wanted to see what they had in the next aisle because I know you guys remember from my last video, they did have the fall glass cups there. But as I was walking, I found these adorable Hello Kitty shot glasses. They were only $5.99 and they had two styles. I love this one with all the different colored bows. It was so cute. After spotting those shot glasses, I looked at the tumblers and they had this adorable water jug. I loved how it had all the strawberries on it and it said be kind always. It was only $7.99, which I thought was a really good price. Then I headed to the blankets. I wanted to see if they had the Hello Kitty blanket here. I did look in the kids section just to make sure I did not miss anything. Just because when I found the Hello Kitty blanket, I didn't even know there was a Hello Kitty blanket coming to Burlington. So I was like, let me just check everything. Let me see if there's like a folded one, like the one at Home Goods, or if they have any sheets or anything. But as I was looking, I really didn't spot anything, but I'm glad I checked just to make sure. I also wanted to check under everything just to make sure an employee or a customer didn't hide anything. But as I was walking to the shirts, I spotted this adorable Hello Kitty and Friends shirt. It was more like of a crop top, but it was $7.99. I thought that was a really good price. They also had this adorable Barbie shirt. I loved how it had the heart with the flames. This one was $8.99. They did have a lot of Barbie and Hello Kitty and Friends shirts. This one was probably my favorite. It was also $7.99. But you'll see coming up that I also found this Kiromi shirt. But I hate how all the black shirts are look very, very faded. I just, ugh, it looks old and it makes me not want to buy it. 
but I went to another aisle where they had blankets just to make sure and they really didn't have anything As I was walking, I saw that they had these adorable steering wheel covers. I loved the leopard one. But you guys, this location had so many sections of blankets. They had like a, a fall section, a regular section, like regular blankets. They also had like a kid section. They had a section where there was thick ones. But as I was leaving, I checked the queue line and they had this adorable Hello Kitty penguin mug. And they also had this mug with all the little faces on it. I feel like that one would look really cute with the shot glasses that we found. And here's day three of hunting and first stop was home goods. And I ended up finding these adorable ghost measuring cups. I was looking for those and I was so happy that I found them. They also had these pillows that I thought were super cute for Halloween. After home goods, I headed to TJ and look what I found. I was so happy to find the new hot pink juicy purse. Then I went to Five and Below and oh my gosh, you guys, the last one in my size. I was so happy. They also had all these other adorable Hello Kitty and Friends items. They even had these plush dinglers. I really wanted the cowgirl one. I thought that one would be super cute to hang on my little review mirror in my car. They also had these like the little superhero ones that we've seen at Hot Topic. As you can see, I snatched my shirt <laughs> so fast because they had just opened and I didn't want anybody to snatch it. But as I was looking around, I also spotted this other Hello Kitty shirt. And you guys, I ended up seeing a character that I've never seen before. If you guys know the name of this one, please let me know down below in the comments. But then I headed to the dog section because I saw that Five and Below was coming out with a Hello Kitty dog bed. And I was like, oh my gosh, I need one for Honey ASAP. But they did not have it. Then I saw that they had these adorable pajama pants. It had different colored bobas with little macrons. Then as I was about to check out, I saw that they had some Stanley dupes. But I'm not gonna lie, you guys, they did feel a lot thinner than the actual Stanleys. But they did have a cute selection of colors. Here goes these Robins that we've seen everywhere. I still think the packaging is so cute. But after Five Below, I headed to Burlington. And you guys, I spotted these Hello Kitty glass cups. These were so cute. They had little ice creams on each side of her. And I believe these were also only $4.99. And here's day four of hunting. And first stop was TJ Maxx. And I ended up finding all of these adorable Hello Kitty signs. I believe we saw these at Marshall's not too long ago. They also had that dumpling diffuser. And after TJ, I headed to Burlington. And I found more of those Hello Kitty cups. They also had this one that I have not seen in person yet. It had like all the little Hello Kitty characters on it. I was still looking for the fall mug, but I think I missed it, you guys. Please let me know if you see it and if I missed it. But here's day number five of hunting. And first stop was Home Goods. And you guys, look how adorable these pink bean bags were. And the price was not that bad. It was only $40. I thought they were so cute. And if you guys haven't seen, there's a new Christmas Hello Kitty blanket being spotted. I don't know if it's going to Home Goods or TJ Maxx. I'm not too sure, but I was looking for it here. But I did not see it. They still have the fall blankets out. But I've noticed, you guys, that they already are slowing down with Halloween items and they are starting to push out more fall items. Uh, I did check this cart to see if there was any Hello Kitty, but the only thing I saw was this adorable pink pumpkin canister. But you guys, there's a new Halloween Hello Kitty baking dish. She's dressed up as a little pirate and it's so cute. I think there's also like a mixing bowl coming out as well that matches the baking dish. But they did have these Hello Kitty mugs. I thought it was so cute. But the price was $6.99. I was like, ooh, that's a little much. But they also did have these Hello Kitty plates. They were only $5.99. And as I was walking up to the front, I saw that they had more of the Hello Kitty disposable cups. And next stop was the mall. I ended up going to Hot Topic first. And they had this adorable Halloween Hello Kitty and Friends hoodie. They also had the matching pants to go with it. 
If you guys have made it this far into my video, please make sure to like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you guys can be notified every time I post. It really does truly help out my channel. Alright, let's get right back into the video. They had these Kiromi eyelashes and I thought they were so cute. They were only $6.90. They also had the stickers that we've seen in one of my last videos. They also had these Hello Kitty scrunchies and you guys... Who remembers silly bands? They had Sanrio silly bands. They, they also had this Hello Kitty and Friends Lounge Fly Halloween backpack and wallet. You guys, it was so cute. I believe the backpack was $50 and the wallet was $22.90. But this day, it was buy one get one 30 so that would have been a really good deal. They also had this adorable pastel Halloween crossbody bag with all the little Sanrio characters on it. I thought it was so cute. I believe that one was $33. They also had that Halloween Mickey Mouse sweater and they had these Sanrio socks. Each character was holding a little boba. I thought it was so cute. Then if you've been to the Deerbrook Mall, you guys, in Houston, you know that this store has been here forever. I wanted to see if they had any Hello Kitty and they did have a few things. They did have a few plushies on this wall that they had. They also had a Kiromi shirt and a Hello Kitty hoodie, but the prices here were not that good. This hoodie was $30 and the material was very thin. They also had these cute magnets. These were $5.95, which weren't too bad. They were really cute. I did like the Kiromi one. And they also had this Hello Kitty lanyard. It had her on the little chain right there and her with the strawberry head it was like it had a different pattern on each side of the lanyard then i went to forever 21 to see if they put out any new hello kitty items but they only had like the leftover stuff i did see people posting that they were already putting out like halloween hello kitty shirts and stuff so i'm really excited to see those but at this location they only had a few pajamas a few jackets and only a few accessories. My favorite thing that was left was this adorable sweater. I love how it had all the characters on it and it was only black and white. And then they also had this adorable Hello Kitty purse. It was tiny, but y'all, it was $30. So I was like, mm, no thanks. After the mall, I headed to Marshall's and they had this adorable pink pumpkin mug set i thought it was a really good price it was priced at 6.99 then they also had this hot pink tumbler it was so cute i love the shade of hot pink it was 7.99 and you guys they also had this baby little outfit it was hello kitty it was so adorable i loved it so much it was only 7.99 that was a really good price they also had this Hello Kitty shirt with the little mushrooms. And then after Marshalls, I headed to Target. And they had these adorable Halloween mugs. I'm obsessed with the ghost. And that pumpkin was adorable. But you guys, I kept having to come back to these mugs because there was like so many people in the way. And I didn't want to get anybody on camera. They also had these Simply Modern tumblers. I thought the shades were so beautiful. They were like the perfect fall neutral colors. But did you guys see the new ghost one that they just came out with? I saw an ad for it and I clicked it and they were all sold out. But they were so cute. Hopefully they restock soon. But that's it for this video you guys. Thank you so much for joining me on this week's hunt. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below.